Hi, my name is Rosie. I'm from Trinidad and Tobago and today I'm going to do Brazilian carrot cake with a Trini flavor. I just bought this beauty. Why did I buy it? Because I, I always wanted one. So I decided to invest in one. What COVID has taught me is um, life is so fragile. So I live a little bit. I purchase it. Plus my daughter she has become interested in baking and cooking and she's going to be doing up some batches of cookies so i invested in it so i'm going to do my brazilian carrot cake with a trini flavor in the kitchen needs. stay tuned okay so here i have angostura aromatic bitters this is the trini flavor i told you i'm going to put in the brazilian carrot cake um, this will give it flavor and it will also help to take away the freshness of the eggs in it. Then I have Vanilla Essence here. This is another Trinidad project, product from Baker's. Well, this is a, a local company. They have Vanilla Essence and I'm using their Vanilla Essence in this recipe. Here I already have... Um, two cups of flour, one tablespoon of baking powder, and one cup of sugar. And in my ninja here, I have a mixture of the bitters and the vanilla essence together with three carrots, three quarter cups of oil, and three eggs all blended up together so what i'm going to do now i'm going to turn on my kitchen aid to mix the ingredients oh my it's not plugged in plugged in the wrong thing so plugged in now Remember, it's new to me, people, so. <laughs> up. Right, so there. The dry ingredients are mixing together. So now I'm going to put the wet ingredients. As I said, it's three carrots, three eggs, three quarter cups of oil that I blended together. It's going to be going into here. There we go. And now we're going to put it on again. Mix them together quite nicely. Just mix it a little bit again. Oh, 
Hope you all can see this is mixed together quite nicely. I have my baking pan that has already been greased and also it's greased and powdered. So now it has already been mixed and I'm going to put it in the grease pan. So what I have to do is leave it to the back. Let me see how I can do this so you all can see it. Leave it to the back there. This lever here, right here. So I just like this. And also, yeah, what I have to do is push this up, twist it, and it comes right out. Really nice. There's two areas on the side here that needs to come out and there's one to the back so you just lift it out. Okay. So this is the cake here. Right. The oven has already been preheated to 350 degrees Celsius. And I'm putting it in the oven for 45 minutes. So when it comes out, we'll see how it will come out. Carrot cake is complete. Here we have it. Can you see that? Beautiful golden brown carrot cake. I'm going to do the test. Here's the test. Clean. Sorry. <laughs> oh, beautiful. So the carrot cake is complete. Thanks for watching. Bye.